Now, let's focus on the method of sampling first. In general, there are five apparatus needed to collect personal samples. Now, we will look at the method of analysis. The retentate is analyzed by flame AAS with the following reagents used. Step 1. Calibrate each personal sampling pump with a representative sample in line with the following procedures. The flow rate of sample air must be accurately known and between 1 to 4 litres per minute for up to 8 hours to collect a total sample size of 200 to 1,500 litres for time-weighted average TWA measurement. However, the filter loading must not exceed 2 mg total dust. Step 3. Open the cassette filter holders and transfer the samples and blanks to clean beakers. Step 4. Add 3 ml of concentrated nitric acid and 1 ml of 30% weight over weight hydrogen peroxide into a watch glass and cover it. Start reagent blanks at this step. Step 5. Heat the hot plate to 140 degrees Celsius and stop when the volume is reduced to about 0.5 ml. Step 6. Steps 4 and 5 are repeated 2 more times by using 2 ml of concentrated nitric acid and 1 ml of 30% weight over weight hydrogen peroxide each time. Step 7. Rinse the watch glass and walls of the beaker with 3 to 5 ml of 10% volume over volume nitric acid when the sample is dry. The solution should be evaporated to dryness. Step 8. Each beaker must be cooled and the residues should be dissolved in 1 ml of concentrated nitric acid. Step 9. Transfer the solution to a 10 ml volumetric flask and dilute to volume with distilled water. Step 10. Set up the AAS as specified by the manufacturer. Step 11. Aspirate standards, samples and blanks. Record the absorbance readings. Step 12. By using the measured absorbance values, estimate the corresponding concentration of lead in the samples with unit of microgram per milliliter from the calibration graph.